Hey YouTube, what's happening? What's up here? Uh, I'm gonna do a weird, we ain't just had a barbecue. Uh, the old girl and Fraz was here and we had something to eat. We're gonna do a quick update on our eBay and we're gonna show you how to make a box for shipping. Here in Canada, the post office does not supply us with boxes, we have to supply our own boxes. So this is a quick fix to ship a couple of cars. So this will be a quick update. We sold 19 Hot Wheels to somewhere in Quebec. And the total was, if I could find it, total was uh, 107.25 plus uh, shipping. Uh, I shipped another one, a Porsche, and it went to, I think it was Quebec as well, $5.99 plus shipping. I sold uh, two Toyota pickup trucks. I will put pictures here or here so that you can see what, what actually sold. Uh, two, two Toyota Tacoma pickup trucks for $24. They went down to the States. Um, I sold uh, a lot of four. Silverados for $7.99. They went Ontario, somewhere in Ontario, I believe. Uh, okay, we shipped a Matchbox Chevy Avalanche for $4.99 plus shipping. That was in Canada as well. Uh, okay, we sold this. It's going to be here or it'll be here. Whatever I get to, we'll get to that. Um, uh, Ghostbusters set, Ecto-1 and Ecto-2, it's got the bike and, and, and the car, Ghostbusters car, from the new movie, the second one I believe, it was the second movie, that sold for $13.50 plus shipping. We sold uh, <clears throat> one bone shaker pillow pack from probably four years ago that came out, and it sold for $4.99 plus shipping. I've got uh, a 65 Chevy Impala from the Boulevard series. That was uh, well, probably 2012 that came out. And we sold that one for $10 plus shipping. That went USA. I'm pretty sure it went USA. Okay, we've got two Camaros that sold. They, these are sold in Ontario. Uh, one for, uh, two of them sold for 10 bucks. And I have this uh, Hot Wheels Tail Dragger, the Christmas set that came out in year in 2001, 2000-ish, somewhere in, in that line. I sold her $15 and that went to the States as well. Uh, we sold the Nissan GTR for $4.99. That one went to, I think it was in Canada. Uh, for four ninety nine plus shipping, this is the purple one. I've sold, I don't know how many of those, probably six or eight of them. We have a 65 Dodge Coronet Drag Strip Demon. It was uh, $15 and that went, I think it's Canada. I, I, I'm, I'm not sure, but I think so. Uh, one more just for kicks. A Hot Wheels Neo Classic 70 Roadrunner. It sold for $30, and that went down the states. Texas, I think it was. Those are some of the cars we sold. We, it's been slow, you know, summer slowdown, right? It's always like that. As I was saying, here in Canada, um, our post office, they don't supply us with boxes. We have to supply our own boxes. So I'm going to give you a quick um, how to make a box. It, it's pretty simple. I got these two parts of boxes that I... Uh, pick up at Walmart, right? The soup, soup boxes, whatever, they work. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut off the corner and then we're gonna cut off the other corner. So the four corners are now cut. I tear off this tab. Now I'm going to put some um, stuffing in the box just just for 
so the, the item doesn't move. You can use paper, you can use bubble wrap. Bags work quite well too. And I'm going to put one Hot Wheel in there just, just to show you how it would work. <clears throat> then I'll put another bag on top. I will take this, the lid, right? Flip it, put it over top, and then we would take. Simple box, really, really easy to use. I've been doing this method with these boxes for years and years and years. I'll do another video shortly of how you can turn a Pepsi box into a box. I didn't bring one with me, I should have, but well that's it. Quick, quick, simple. Uh, if you're in, a, you're in a spot and you need a box to ship a couple of cars or whatever, like if you sell, I don't know, CDs or what, if you're not using a bubble wrap, it's an easy box to build. That, how long did that take? A minute and a half? It's, it's a piece of cake. Thanks guys, don't forget to subscribe. We're slow, I know. My fault, I don't put very many videos up, but when we do, we do, we have fun. Uh, thanks for us, for the camera. Thanks Casey for putting up with me. And, uh, peace.